Yo, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome to another video on Forza Horizon 2. And this episode, we're going to open a lot of wheel spins. Basically, I've been collecting wheel spins for a very, very, very long time. I don't know how many I actually have because basically it only says 9 plus. Um, so you don't know how many you have above that. Uh, but I'm thinking quite a bit because I haven't, like, redeemed one since forever. Like, quite literally forever. And sorry, that curb fucked me up back there. Um, but yeah, I haven't redeemed one since forever and I don't know how many are stacked up. But we're going to go through and we're going to open up a load of these. Get them rolling around here. Get them rolling. So let's go. I'm going to do this on the controller. It'll be a little bit easier, I suppose, <coughs> um, to quickly do this. Um, so there you go. It says 9 plus, uh, but I don't know how many we actually have. But let's just roll through these, see what we get, see if we get anything nice and juicy. Okay, started off very juicy. <laughs> Jaguar E Type S1. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's spin again then. That was a very good first spin, you know. So I've got my leg up here. You like my leg? Ooh. <laughs> oh my god, BMW M3 for the second car. What the hell? Am I getting lucky or something? Or <laughs> That's crazy. I was just thinking about making one of those M3s the other day as well. Because I run the E36 a lot. And I want to try a different car. Uh, but this car feels so amazing that I don't really need to change it. Um, okay, Audi TT, RS Coupe. Pretty nice, pretty nice car right there. Uh, but yeah, I just want to see what the outcome of these wheel spins are. Um, I don't know how many I've actually got, so I don't know how long we're going to roll on doing this. Uh, but hopefully I have got quite a few. Uh, I'm thinking probably about 50 probably stacked up, I would have thought. 110,000 credits. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> Okay, so congrats. You just bagged our top cash prize. Why don't you head over to the auto show and buy yourself something? Okay, apparently 110,000 credits is the highest you can get. I didn't I didn't even know that. I generally did not know that. Okay, we just got really lucky then. Come on. Okay, then then we get the other end of the scale, which is like 3,300 credits. You ain't getting no more than that. <laughs> Oh god, uh, but yeah, I wish you could see how many wheel spins you actually had because when it says 9 plus it is kind of annoying because I wanted to kind of I wanted to split these out like across episodes if you know what I mean um, get them like equally spread it out, do some drifting then do some wheel spins uh, but seeing as I don't know how many there are I can't really split them out too much so we're going to keep going just a little bit more um, let's go to 4 minutes in the video and we will carry on with some drifting um, but we're getting some nice, nice collections here. I'm not gonna lie. Um, it, was, it was really good at the start, to be fair. Just pulled up with a Jaguar E-Type, and then we follow it up with a BMW M3, and then that Audi TT as well. So now we're just getting coins, um, not the highest amount of coins either. Uh, but we did get 110,000, which is crazy. Um, so let's just keep going here. Um, still don't know how many we actually have, but okay, Toyota C. Celica GT4 that could be a very nice drift car no, uh, I don't know it looks nice I do like the look of Celica GT4s um, a lot of people probably w might not agree with me there but they are a very very nice car uh, Lancia Stratos HF Stradel okay to be fair that was a very very quick car on Forza 5 whenever I done B-class grip racing I think that was always at the top that was a very very good uh, grip car so I don't know uh, but yeah, I think that's going to do for um, the wheel spins for this episode. We're still saying 9+, plus, so we've still got a lot more to go, uh, which is perfect. Oh. Um, so let's get some drifting going uh, around this section right here. Uh, I'm kind of surprised by those wheel spins, because to be fair, I actually got quite some good stuff right then. Uh, like, it started off like really well. Generally, I got some very, very nice cars out that first bit. Which is crazy. And then it, it slowed down a tiny bit, and then 110,000 credits came out the bot, which is like, what? <laughs> How you do this? And then. Okay, well, that curb. That curb gets me every single time. I need to take that line further inside, it's really annoying. Like, I've been running this section for such a long time that I'm trying to eke out a little bit more speed on it, if you know what I mean. Because uh, I, I, I like drifting fast. Um, I'm not going to lie, that's why I mostly run. Um, V8s, and obviously I'm on the wheel, so it is a little bit faster than controller. 
uh, but that's mainly coming out of the corner onto the straight. Like when you're in the corner, there's no difference to be honest. Uh, but it's just like transitions and stuff like that. It's a little bit, a little bit quicker. Um, but I'm trying to eke out a little bit, a little bit more speed on on sections, if you know what I mean. Because even like Forza Four, when I used to drift kind of competitively um, on controller, that was. I used to, I used to be one of the fastest. I'm not gonna lie there. I'm not being like big headed or something. Uh, but I generally used to drift fast, and it kind of just got into my head that I like. I like eking out speed uh, without losing kind of that angle, if you know what I mean. So I try and take the most of the track, but take a line that is eking out the most speed. Um, so I need to take it wide on that on that bit where I keep hitting the curb, um, but I can't take it too wide to where I drop a tire on the curb because curbs in this game, if you didn't know, they kill you. <laughs> you generally die if you hit one of those curbs. You are dead, and you ain't coming back from it, mate. So there we go kind of pushed it out to the curb, we got a little bit on the curb, um, revs went a lot higher, um, seeing as the tyre was off the floor on the curb, but it felt a lot better, we didn't, the curb didn't wreck us, so a little bit better line that time, but yeah, this section is really, really nice, I really like drifting this section, it's kind of like a tight section, I suppose, but it's not that tight, it's generally not, like, once you get used to it, it is a very, very, very nice section. Um, this corner here is probably the best corner of the game, like, to be fair. Perfect speed, um, it's very smooth, there's no bumps in the road. It's just like a perfect all-round drift corner right there. Um, so if you haven't tried out this section, I recommend you do try it out, because it is a very, 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 very good drift section. It's probably one of the, my most drifted. Um, I really enjoy drifting this, so... That's that, and yeah, I hope you guys like the, the wheel spin aspect. <laughs> to this because I want to see what turn, uh, turn 10 and playground uh, play <laughs> play um, games actually give us um, because obviously like doing one now and then you kind of just don't note down what you actually receive um, but when you do it all at once you can kind of gather what you're actually getting and to be fair it was probably I probably got about four very very good items um, like the 110,000 credits, uh, BMW M3, even though it wasn't worth a lot, but in my eyes that is a good item. Uh, the Stratos, uh, what else did we get? The Audi TT, uh, what did you get right at the start? Oh yeah, Jaguar E-Type. Okay, maybe there was like four or five, but seeing as you look back at the video and stuff, um, you kind of notice that, yeah, we opened quite a few of them, so to get five out of however many we opened, I don't know if it's a good ratio or not, because we probably opened about 20, 20 wheel spins. I don't know why I keep saying open, because it's not... I think I'm playing FIFA right now, you know? <laughs> Opening that pack and something. <laughs> um, but... Sorry, I looked away then. I generally just looked away. Uh, but let's... <laughs> let's head over here. Uh, because I, I saw my phone vibrate, I thought I was getting a call, but... Yeah, I, I wasn't, I wasn't. I thought I was popular, uh, popular for once, you know? <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it's, it's nice seeing what you can actually get, um, seeing as, I don't know how many wheel spins I've got, which is kind of an annoying feature they added into the game, I suppose. Just saying 9+, plus is really, really, not frustrating, but it's annoying not actually seeing uh, what you're actually getting, uh, because I'd like to see how many wheel spins I actually have, so just so I can split them out um, evenly across that episodes, but seeing as I'm going in blind, I'm kind of just do, doing it on time, I'm just going to do like 4 minutes of wheel spins and then, and then I'll just drift the rest to like 10 minutes, 12 minutes, I don't know till I get bored of um, talking utter shit like I am now. Um, but yeah, thank you for the support on this channel by the way, I appreciate everyone who's giving support on this channel right now. Obviously, I have 11,000 subscribers, as some of you may know, uh, but that was mainly probably about a year ago when the Forza 4... Um, my channel blew up, I'm not going to lie, and it got a little bit too much, so I, I had to take a break, uh, but that break that was only planned for like a couple of weeks or something, it turned into like a month, then it turned into another month, and then it got to the point where I had a break on YouTube for about a year, and as you probably would expect, uh, a lot of people went inactive, um, not looking out for videos and stuff, and a new YouTube, uh, when you don't start clicking on people's videos in the sub box, their videos get uh, removed from your sub box, so 
there might be some people that are still active out there, but because obviously it was a year, uh, some people might not have clicked on one of my videos for a long time, uh, so they don't actually show up in their sub box anymore, which is kind of annoying. Uh, but you know, I, ne I needed a break. Uh, but when you get into a break from YouTube, it is kind of nice just playing games, enjoying games with your friends, and not actually worrying about recording. But seeing as we're back in this now, um, I appreciate all the support, all the people that stayed around as well. Oh, like before that one year break, uh, they know about the sayings, they know about God Dish, God Dish, uh, they know about all sorts. So I appreciate everyone that stuck around for that long. Uh, thank you very much, and thank you very much for every like on the video. Every comment means a lot as well. I try to reply to every comment, uh, but seeing as I do work full time, it is kind of annoying. Um, coming over at 5 o'clock, making a video, friending it out. Uh, by the time I've done that, it's like 8, 9 o'clock at night, and it's like. I want to play the game, like, I want to play the game with friends, I want to get used to the game, I want to have fun on the game, and you can't capture that uh, really while, while recording to be honest, uh, you could try to capture it, um, but seeing as Xbox took away the feature of capturing game chat, capturing party chat and stuff like that, it's hard to catch capture emotions on a game if you know what I mean, because you can't hear the other people you're talking to, um, but yeah. That was that for that. Hope you guys liked the wheel spins at the start. Something a little bit different added in. And yeah, we got Jackie Reed type. We got 110,000 credits. Pretty nice, I think. Pretty nice. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. And let's wait for the next one, right? <laughs> Sometime in the future. It's not going to be a year, though.